What's up, Chang Gang? Wilson here back with another video. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. For this video, I'm going to be watching and reacting to Ben and Ben and SB19 Bang Ya Rihan. During SB19, hopefully I said that right. But the official lyric video, it's on Ben and Ben's channel. This came out back in August of 2021. Very, very behind. Many months behind, but you guys actually suggested this and I saw. Thank you guys. I'm aware that this is a lyric video and this is probably going to be in Tagalog, so I'll try my best to decipher it and to give off my own analysis. Hence, I'll be pausing this from time to time to give my thoughts. So if you want to watch the original video without any interruption whatsoever, check out the link in the description below. And if you haven't already, please give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button because I welcome you all to the Chan Gang with open arms. And lastly, I want to give a happy birthday shout out to Cecile Alunan. Thank you for reaching out to me and for showing love and support because I react to SB19. Happy, happy 45th birthday, let's go! So it's currently the 20th for me. I know in the Philippines time, it's probably 21st by now, but happy belated birthday then. Hope you had an amazing day with friends, family, and loved ones in general. I truly appreciate the support. So without further ado, let's get right into the video, guys. TV. Inaman kami na kulang sa aming pagkulawa. Di ka namin isusukan. Ooh, that felt like a really heavy and impactful start. Like the harmony from Ben and Ben, like their voices are just so compelling and addicting to listen to. How the notes are just dragged out and you're just like, whoa. Plus with like the instrumentals and the beat like dun dun brings a lot of intensity to it. So far, it sounds kind of deep and personal and I feel like it's as if they're confronting someone. The fact that they're just like, who do you think you are? Guess we'll find out with more lyrics. I really need to focus on that. Wow, I'm like getting chills from this. It's like so beautiful. Like there's just so much depth in their voices. I just feel like right now it's broad. There could be a lot of interpretations, conflict within yourself or conflict with someone specific. Like what makes you think you have all this power? Like I'm not even sure if it's power over quote unquote them. But it was just like the darkness will fall and Deep lyrics. I see people in the background. Wow. Dang, this song goes crazy. Those really hard, raspy verses from Ken, Pablo, I think I even heard Josh, and then to continue it on with Stell singing. I don't even know if they're talking about like a present day type of thing. It could be something in regards to the past. 
where there's people subjected and shot down as slaves, like the rulers kind of, kind of like bending everyone to their will, and just showing off so much power, like who do they think they are? So it is kind of hard for me to decipher who they're talking about, but there's just a lot of like metaphors expressing that they're being forced to submit under whoever. It could even be like submitting to their dark thoughts or just the negatives. But dang, this song, it just feels so powerful and chill at the same time. <laughs> Okay, so this is like the main chorus. It's like repeating itself is getting really, really catchy. And it's definitely the sing-along part. Da, 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 da. Yeah, you guys have to let me know your thoughts and interpretations about this. Like, what does this song mean to you? It's like you've been put down for so long. Eventually, you want to break free like a bird. So it's like, do you think you could condemn me with all that power and hold me down? life no it's not the truth will come out and you will fall as in you the darkness so this could be like a motivational thing and inspiring type of song especially if you think about it mentally it's like you could think about a lot of pain and suffering and things that just put you in a very depressive state but then there's always a light at the end of the tunnel which will guide you out of that darkness it's like another saying if you reach rock bottom you can't go any lower than that. You just go up from there. So pick yourself back up. That's just a random thought that this song gives to me. It's, again, so powerful and reflective. Just the powerful vocals and the harmonization behind it, it meshes so well. It's like such profound music, and the truth will guide us, you should serve the people. That part kind of confuses me a little bit. It's like, what are they saying? It's like, you can't hide behind all the lies, the truth will eventually come out. People will be led and inspired by the truth instead of the dark and power hungry. I don't know, but I really like how this makes me think. Man, the instrumentals to follow up with it. It's different. All right, and that was it for the video, guys. I hope you really enjoyed it. Again, feel free to leave your thoughts down in the comment section below and give this video a thumbs up if you haven't already. It would really mean a lot to me. I love all the support. I read the comments and 
it's so cool how you guys keep recommending more things for me to watch because I thoroughly enjoy it. So final thoughts about the song is... Again, it's just so beautiful. I think the lyrics are just extremely deep. I don't even... The song has to do with personal experiences from Ben and Ben or SB19. It could be something beyond that, you know, in history, in life. People have always been oppressed. The truth has always been hidden. Maybe they're just looking for justice for people around the world. It has to do with like history or in some something in that regard. So in a way, it's like, I think they're just trying to wake people up and they just want people to realize what's going on around the world. Stay woke. It could be a lot of things. Maybe like political factors or just societal aspects in life. So it is such a touchy subject when you get into that realm, but music is just very expressive and you could get so many different interpretations. So that's the beauty of it. So this was really fun to watch and react to. Thank you. Thank you. Once again, I may be wrong, but it's okay. It was just a pleasure to listen to this for the first time. But until then, take it easy, guys, and I will see you next time, Chang Gang. Peace out.